hey welcome back again to new video this is you watching sampat sanfix youtube channel and this is poco x3 custom rom reviews you can see here kaleidoscope version this is sunflower leaf unofficial build you can see here 617 latest build and june 5th 2022 security patch version android is 12 kernel user is 4.14.282 optimus drunk surya version 12.9 has been used in this particular rom and i have been running the cp throttling test from last 15 minutes you can see here the max is 160 and the average is 151 and minimum is 122 million jps and it's throttled to 86 percent of its max performance for but as you can see up to certain minutes like eight nine minutes it wasn't throttling later it is a little bit throttling that's not the case here for everyone it might not be the same just this is an app and their settings that's how it is i run this in the morning there's a screenshot actually that's how it is it's fine enough my friend one of them shared in telegram he doesn't have any throttling yes it wouldn't be the same for five minutes and ten minutes even for one hour it wouldn't be the same that's how it is this is a rom home screen you won't get any minus one screen here this is a new type of rom for poco x3 you can see here smooth enough let me increase a little bit of volume here this is a volume panel you get more that's how it is and you print you will get pre-installed gallery application let's start with dialer only you can see here direct video call feature is available and recording call is there but it will announce the other person that you are recording the call that's how the call recording feature and dialer you get basic things are fine enough in the dialer and this is the wi-fi connection i have 100 mbps geo giga fiber connection even with mobile data internet also i checked out it's working fine carrier aggregation is also supported if your location is supported that's how it is and no problem in the earpiece and everything is fine enough no problem regarding that this quick settings panel you get here is smooth enough in the edit section you get these kind of options like location is turned on as you can see and dark theme let me drag here only few are given very simple this is even while setting this rom you can opt out to get to google play services or not that's up to you you can choose out if you want a play store and you want to install apps you can enable that option if you don't want you can skip that and use third party app downloads application it's very clean only few apps are given that's how it is and in the description i have provided the link and flashing method is very simple as the firmware rom zip file format data and reboot to system but you might be knowing that it's just 1 GB or like that 1.1 GB but it is included with this play store just you need to enable during the after flashing you will get option to enable google services then only you will get the play store that you need to keep in mind i would have added the flashing method also but it's very simple i'm just ignored adding that that's how it is it will be again lengthy i hope you guys understand and drm info you get level one certification you can watch all the ott application in hd resolution that's not the problem here and starting with benchmark results the geekbench scores here you can see app opening a little bit taking time but benchmark results is very good 559 single score and 1599 for multi score is very good and the linux 4.14.282 optimus drunk surya version 12.9 has been used here kernel the android 12 version is implemented you won't get any widgets here let me go into clock as you can see it's old type and wallpaper and style change wallpapers that's also not available and these things and at also like wallpaper colors and basic colors dark theme app grid is given you can say those things are fine enough just you won't get any settings here and notification dots is also added you can see bubbles feature conversations this is the home screen you get in this particular rom and enter the benchmark results you can see a little bit app opening is taking little bit of time 364,775 and temperature raise was just 0.7 degrees celsius and three percentage of battery drop has been noticed during this testing it's fine enough the scores are max here 
you can use it as a gaming rom also but let's see how it will handle in bgma will it support a 90 fps directly or not everything will be expensed stay tuned and uh, you get these kind of options i haven't installed safety net status let me install and you can judge the speed also okay i have installed it just run here it's get passed you can use all the payment applications like google pay phone pay paytm whatever you want to use you can use it whatsapp everything is working fine here you can see here everything is working fine no problem regarding this rom camera application i have installed this arnova gcam everything is working fine here you can see ultra wide angle also going to be work fine here that's why many people dm me in insta i have, I have given for lot more people the link of the gcam there in the uh, instagram and even telegram also all the names of my social medias are given in the description you can check out all are in sampath sam facts only you can dm me for further queries don't spam just for the best rom you can watch my videos first then you can comment or dm me in social medias that's how it is contacts clock and there is a principal camera i don't recommend this this is a snapdragon camera maybe that's how it is and let's move into settings as you can see this is the settings panel it's smooth enough i came from abi x roj edition that was little bit smoother than this but this is also very good rom first starts with battery you can see your battery usage i kept like i have using for monday 7 hours i turned off my smartphone maybe and scan time of one hour for the miss battery life is also going to be good enough not bad but not great also and the battery saver is given extreme battery saver is missing and battery manager as usual is given for battery life also you can test it out if you want very good battery life you can check out arrow is the latest version that's also in my channel you can check out display settings you get screen timeout and dark theme it's not in pitch black condition let me show you surprisingly it is in pitch black condition <laughs> i did not expected this in this rom it's in pitch black condition really nice and colors it was adaptive keep it boosted you can increase or decrease the rgb strength from here peak refresh rate you can adjust auto rotate skin minimum refresh rate to smooth display those things are given further moving into the display settings you get hide privacy indicator you can hide them status bar icon tuner is given you can enable or disable from here show seconds in the clock also you can enable or disable from here battery status style you get just three of them and battery percentage you can enable or defect disable from here network traffic indicators are given here if enable that you will get plenty of options as you can see many people ask about this also if you want anything to search just go here and search in the settings you will go to that menu if it is available in the settings and wallpaper sun style as i said before it's working fine accessibility menu is missing here you can see that's a handy feature but just it's missing from here into the system into gestures system navigation i mean gesture navigation nothing options has been given just simple enough like pixel experience or arrow os that's how it is it's very simple rom you get some of the options like laboratory google photos unlimited storage just enable here allow application downgrade ignore windows secure flags these are the some of the options you can enable or disable from here you get gestures options also and location is also working fine here now coming into security options you get screen lock pattern unlock and face unlock also and encryption credentials it is encrypted without watching this you comment down what is the encryption status just watch the video everything will be explained in detail if i forget to add that then you can ask in the comment section i will definitely reply that that's how it is and let me show you the fingerprint unlock first as you can see it's quick enough to unlock your smartphone using the fingerprint unlock and face unlock is also very fast let me show you as you can see it's very quick that is not the case with this kind of avsp stock rooms but here it's very good the fingerprint and face unlock are very very quick enough and i will show you the bgma game plan and wind of the video before that i will show you the 33 watt charger support is there or not stay tuned let me connect you can see here let me connect this should show 
turbo charging or anything like that let me do one thing i will add in the comment section will it fastly charge or not you can see it's showing charging slowly but i have connected 33 watt charger only that is the bummer in this particular rom you won't get any fast charging support i mean 33 watt charging support is not available in this rom that you need to keep in mind as you can see it's charging slowly full in 1 hour 44 minutes i hope you got the answer for fast charging support in this particular rom Reloading! Expired! Cover me! Target down! 
killing spree for the red team! Enemy down! Cover me! And coming to verdict, this is very good ROM. It's a good performance ROM and battle life is also optimum. It's fine enough and charging speeds are very slow because it won't support 33 watt charger. That's the bug or whatever it is. It up to you if you want to use a 10 watt charger. Then this is a very good ROM. The kaleidoscope ROM for Poco X3 with Android version 10. This is the verdict. You can use it as a daily driver if you board with any other AOSP ROMs very good option for like very good optional for this particular ROM is Arrow OS that is very good compared to this one but it is very simple if you don't want any Google Play services like that you can look out this ROM also that's how the verdict for this particular ROM we meet with another interesting video until that take care bye bye for now